Today we're going to review part number PK52249. This is the Pollock 7 circuit breaker junction box. Now this circuit breaker junction box will provide a nice neat clean way to mount multiple circuit breakers to the firewall of your vehicle. The junction box has space for seven separate studded circuit breakers. And here's an example. I pulled one of the circuit breakers that's designed to fit in here. It will allow seven of these to be installed in here. It does provide a nice neat clean mounting point for the, all of the circuit breakers. And if you'll notice this metal bar right here is a bus bar. It helps dissipate any heat buildup that might occur using the circuit breakers. Basically what you would do is on the circuit breakers they have a little indentation on each end and they're designed to line up with the protrusion on each side of here. And what you want to make sure is when you put in a circuit breaker it says aux on one side and battery on the other. So when you install these you want to make sure whatever wiring you have going in is all uh, wired up correctly. But basically the way that you just push them in to the protrusion just like that and it'll hold the circuit breaker in place and then you run your wires in do all your connections. Now it does include with this junction box the grommets, the holes, there's two holes on the side, two holes on each end and whichever two you're not going to use like if you're not if you're going to run them in the ends and not on the side you can just take your solid grommet and just slide it right into place just like that and then if you're going to use the ends it includes four large hole grommets that you can just slide in like that on each end in the same way over here and then that way when you go to put your lid on it pretty much protects any elements from getting into inside there and affecting your circuit breakers does also come with four lid screws so once your lid's going to be attached just like that put your screws in there tighten those down to hold your lid into place and it also comes with 14 nuts and what those nuts are for is if you use seven circuit breakers you'll have two nuts for attaching your wires to the circuit breaker <clears throat> and then just to pop off circuit breaker will just pop off it's held on in those protrusions on the indentations of the circuit breaker now I do want to give you a few measurements on this put the lid back on Let's put it over the there we go just like that so the measurement I'm going to give you is the length and I'm not going to include the little mounting tabs so the overall length is going to be seven and a half inches long the width is going to be three and three quarters wide and then the height with the lid on is going to be right at two and a half inches and then if you take the lid off the height without the lid is going to be right at one and three quarter inches. And then the measurement, if you're needing the, mount, the measurement of the bolt pattern mounting, will measure center to center lengthwise and then center to center widthwise. So if we put a ruler on it, this way lengthwise is going to be right at eight and one eighth inches. And center to center on the mounting holes is going to be right at three and three sixteenths center to center for the mounting pattern that way. <clears throat> Go and just pop the grommets back off. Just like that. And I'll put the lid back on and that should do it for the review on part number PK52249, the Pollock 7 Circuit Breaker Junction Box.